Hey guys, this is Agoronator here, and today I'm bringing you guys my Call of Duty Advanced Warfare multiplayer wishlist, which I thought would be a good idea to do right before we get the multiplayer reveal on August 11th, so in a couple of days' time. But yeah, these are just a few things that I really want to see coming back into multiplayer from previous Call of Duties, or things I don't want to return at all in COD AW. Um, so yeah, first off, I would like good spawns. Now, for those of you wondering what a good spawn is, I would classify it as not dying within 5-10 to 10 seconds of spawning in, which may not seem like a lot, but Call of Duty is a very fast-paced game that tries to get you back in the action, so I think 5-10 to 10 seconds would be uh, acceptable. Now, with Ghosts and sometimes Black Ops 2, there were some really bullshit spawns, like you'd spawn a few feet from an IED, or you could literally watch someone spawn in, and then of course they could shoot you because you weren't expecting to die right off the bat. So, also I don't want spawns where people can watch you spawn in, or are directly around the corner for me to run into, which may be quite hard for them to do, but I'd rather wait an extra couple of seconds for the game to find a safe spawn for me, than to get back in the action straight away, and just die instantly but that's just my opinion. The next thing I would like is a decent time to kill with guns, equipment and just about everything. Now of course I want everything to be balanced as well, but I don't want it like Ghosts where two bullets would kill you most of the time or like Black Ops 2 where you can sponge about 20. If they could get it somewhere in between or maybe a bit more on the side of Black Ops 2 then that would be awesome and I think I would enjoy it a lot more. Next up, I'd like a fresh new COD experience, uh, I just want them to take a little bit more risks and keep the COD feel but not have the same old same old COD with just a few new guns and a wacky new single player campaign, but really add some new features so it actually feels like the next instalment in the series. However, I think Sledgehammer Games can get it right, especially with this new concept of exosuits in multiplayer, adding new movement and control mechanics, but fingers crossed. I would also like to see them bring back the original prestige and unlockable system, so not using points to get whatever gun you wanted whenever you want, but unlocking guns and equipment at certain levels, obviously the better guns at the higher levels. And uh, then when you prestige you should have to lose everything, and then work your way back up to the top, giving it a better sense of achievement I guess, when you actually do it. Linking to that, I want them to have a ghost style creator class system, so you have allocated points that uh, you can spend on perks, guns and equipment. I think it was maybe 10 or 12 points you got to spend uh, in ghosts, but yeah, something like that would be nice uh, using the old unlockable system as well. I'd also like Call AW to have slightly quicker ranking up than Ghosts, which I felt was quite slow, maybe with the max level being about 50, but that all depends on actually how quick you rank up. Next, I'd really love them to be running Call of Duty Advanced Warfare on a new engine. Not a heavily modified version of the old engine, which is what Ghost did, but an actually brand new built from the bottom up engine, which is actually possible now that the developers get an extra year to make their game. So hopefully that is what they've done, which would allow them to fix a lot of uh, the things that have been in COD since the start, like head camping or head glitching and other silly stuff like that. So uh, yeah, that would be really nice. The next thing I want is a really good third mode that could maybe even live up to the zombies, although I very much doubt it. Uh, I have a feeling that it's going to be just spec ops or survival like Modern Warfare 3 did, although I hope not. There's also a chance it could be like Call of Duty Online's Robot Zombies, which is a free Call of Duty for China when they had their console ban or something like that uh, a couple of years ago, so yeah, it could be that, it could be uh, survival, it could be something brand new, who knows? Second to last here we have League Play, so I really enjoyed the Black Ops 2 style of competitive multiplayer, especially when I reached the max level and prestige, and didn't really have too much else to do with multiplayer, so it was fun for me and my friends to kind of test our skills against uh, other tryhards and uh, sometimes come out on top, so that would be good if they could implement that kind of style back into Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And last but not least here, I would like them to bring back more airbase killstreaks, especially the higher end ones, as I kind of felt that ghost killstreaks were pretty much all ground based and weren't particularly good, so I'd like them to bring more heavy arms, kind of choppers and airstrikes and stuff like that, so you can kind of rain down terror on the map, and uh, it would feel a bit more rewarding when you actually get them. Uh, I'd also like them to bring back the Black Ops 2 style of, uh, well, score streaks, I best, rather than uh, rather than kill streaks, which is a bit more rewarding for everyone. But yeah, those are some of the things I'd like them to do with Call of Duty Advanced Warfare's multiplayer. If you enjoyed, leave a like and be sure to let me know in the comments uh, what you would like to see in Call of Duty's multiplayer. I'll definitely have fun reading them and subscribe for more Call of Duty Advanced Warfare stuff from myself. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time.